as police broaden investigations into the murder of the head of Shia Muslims, Sheikh Abdul Qadir Muwaya, in Mayuga district, the number of suspects arrested in connection with the killing has now risen from 4 to 13. Police Chief General Kale Kaihura, who has been here for two days, now says he will pitch camp in the eastern district until something concrete comes out of the investigations. This incident will not scare us. Because the, 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 the objective of terrorism is to, to breed fear. He is optimistic the suspects will lead police to those behind the murder. The investigation is focusing on how the killing was executed. For, for me, as Inspector General of Police, I want to understand what is their pattern. Can we see who are these individuals? Is it, as I say, is it organized crime? Is it terrorism? Like in previous cases, the police chief says there was laxity in security which the assailants exploited to carry out the murder. How do they shoot, shoot, shoot and then disappear? So, so close to town. It's an indictment and I'm not going to have it. Since 2012, three Muslim leaders have been killed in eastern Uganda. We tasked General Kaihura on what could have gone wrong and who is killing them. Those who were killed before had been linked to ADF and had actually uh, abandoned that, that line and were preaching against terrorism. So we suspect that that could have been a reason for, for their being targeted. Sheikh Abdul Karim Sentamu of William Street Mosque in Kampala was also murdered under mysterious circumstances in 2012. In a bid to avert more murders, General Kaihura has ordered the police marine unit to routinely patrol all water bodies surrounding the district. In fact, we're going to have to put a patrol, patrol boats here between Majanje and Jinja to, to, to secure the, to, secure the to, to, to block the Nani. As the police follow the trail of Sheikh Muwaya's killers, it remains unclear why his assailants wanted him dead. But security sources told NTV that their investigation will focus on political and religious differences. Yeah,